happy to see all you here i uh, and i think music was a powerful on a tool uh, to spread positivity to spread love and ipo in the time la i think it's the most important tool uh, to spread love uh my thanks to noise and grains for for putting this together uh, it's going to be one of the most memorable shows for me and my band i'm sure for everyone that's there and for all of you uh, again thank you so much uh, chennai chennai da enoda home inga da na chennai la ponda i grew up in the us but i always feel like my roots are here in the city has has accepted me given me so much love so this show is our way to give back to the people of chennai uh, we can't wait and it's going to be full of music love and great great energy sir motha etna part paada poringa enna enna language etna part na the show will go for about 3 hours so on the time la evlo part paada mudiyumo avlo pa so maybe around 30 35 songs uh languages will, will span all my languages mostly tamil lots of telugu some malayalam songs i've sung uh maybe one or two hindi songs but mostly tamil telugu and then those few malayalam songs now i've also done a lot of compositions in english so we'll throw in a couple of those so it'll span it has highlights iruka unga kuda vera yaaru paadranga ad we're planning now so everyone will see when the show happens sir senior singers yaradu unga kuda paada porangala ad theriyala no we're just in the process of conceptualizing the show um possibly hopefully maybe that'll be nice ஓகே இதில் வந்து உங்கள் பாடல்கள் மட்டும் பாட போகிறீங்களா இல்லை மற்ற இசையமைப்பாளர்கள் இசையமைத்த பாடல்கள்லாம் பாட போகிறீங்களா இல்லை வேறு சாங்ஸ்லாம் இருக்கும் ஸோ என்னோடய ஷோ பார்த்தீங்கன்னா இல் ஹாவ் மை சாங்ஸ் ஐ சாங் ஃபார் ஃபில்ம் அண்ட் பிசைஸ் தேட் எனக்கு என்ன சாங்ஸ் நிறையா பிடிச்சிருக்குன்னு லைக் நிலா காய்கிறது வி சிங்கிள் ஆர்ட் லாட்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஏஆர் சார் சாங்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் த நைன்டீஸ் ஆர் சம் ஆஃப் மை ஃபேவரட் சாங்ஸ் ஸோ அது மோஸ்ட்லி இருக்கும் அண்ட் வில் ட்ரை சம் நியூ திங்ஸ் அஸ் வெல் கப்புள் சாங்ஸ் வி நெவர் பெர்ஃபார்ம் பிஃபோர் வில் ஆல்சோ ப்ரிமியர் ஹியர் ஆஃபர் பேத் ஓகே பொதுவாக இது போன்ற ஒரு நிகழ்ச்சிகள்லாம் வந்து வெளிநாட்டு கலைஞர்களுக்கு வந்து அதிகமான வாய்ப்புகள் தருவாங்க நீங்கள் எப்படி அதாவது மியூசிஷியன் சைடில் மியூசிஷியன் சைடில் என்னோடய பேண்ட் செட் ஐ பெர்ஃபார்ம் வித் த சேம் பேண்ட் எவ்ரி டைம் டூ தௌசண்ட் சிக்ஸ்டீன்லேருந்து இந்த ஒரே பேண்ட் தான் ஸோ தேர் லைக் மை பிரதர்ஸ் தேர் லைக் மை ஃபேமிலி அண்ட் வீ பெர்ஃபார்ம் டுகெதர் ஸோ வி ஹேவ் தட் கெமிஸ்ட்ரி ஆன் ஸ்டேஜ் டுகெதர் ஸோ பி த சேம் பேண்ட் ஆஸ் ஆல்வேஸ் சார் இந்த பிப்ரவரி பதினாலு லவர்ஸ் டே அதுக்கு முன்னால் இந்த ஃபங்க்ஷன் நடத்துகிறீங்களா காதலர்களுக்குலாம் ஏதாவது சிறப்பு தள்ளுபடி எதுவும் உண்டா டிக்கெட்டில் இல்லை அதில் இன்னொரு கொஸ்டின் ஆட் பண்ணுங்கள் அங்கே நீங்கள் யாரோ ப்ரப்போஸ் பண்ணுற பிளான் அந்த மாதிரி ஏதாவது இருக்கா அது கூட கேட்டுக்கோங்க ஃபுல் ஷோ மியூசிக் ஃபோக்கஸ் தான் அவ்வளோதான் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ பே ஃபுல் பேண்ட் மெம்பர்ஸ்லாம் சென்னை தான் தேர் ஃப்ரம் ஹியர் மை பிரதர்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் ஹியர் லைக் மை செல்ஃப் ஓகே நீங்கள் இப்போ சமீப காலமாக வந்து நாட்டுப்புற கலைஞர்கள்லாம் குரல் கொடுத்துட்டு வரீங்க இந்த இப்போ பாட போகிற நிகழ்ச்சியில் அவங்களுக்கு ஏதாவது வாய்ப்புகள் கொடுக்க போகிறீங்களா அந்த மாதிரி பாடல்கள்லாம் பாட இருக்கிறீங்களா டெஃபினெட்லி அகேன் ஹூ ஒர் கண்ட் பிரிங் ஆன் ஸ்டேஜ் ஹூ ஆஸ் வில் பி தேர் வித் மீ ஒர் ஸ்டில் டிசைடிங் பட் இட் வில் டெஃபினெட்லி ஹைலைட் தேர் இஸ் வெல் அது சோல தான் மடி மீது நீ தூங்கிடு இமை போல நான் காக்க கனவாய் நீ மாறிடு மயில் தோகை போலே விரதுன்னை வருடும் மனப்பாடமாய் உரையாடல் நிகழும் விழி நீரும் வீணாக இமை தாண்ட கூடாதன துளியாக நான் சேர்த்தேன் கடலாக கண்ணானதே மறந்தாலும் நான் உன்னை நினைக்காத நாளில் பிரிந்தாலும் என் அன்பு ஒரு போதும் பொயில்லையே थैंक यू சார் மியூசிக் டைரக்டர் ஆறீங்க நாளைக்கு மணிர் சார் இது அந்த சாங் வந்து கச்சிரில இருக்கும் ஆ डेफिनेटா இருக்கும் ஒரு ஐ டோ நோ விச் சாங்ஸ் பட் वी கேன் डेफिनेटली இன்क्लूड சம் ஆஃப் தோஸ் சாங்ஸ் फ्रॉम தட் ஆல்பம் வெரி எக்ஸைட்டட் டுமாரோ வானம் கொட்டட்டோ மேலோஸ் கமிங் அவுட் சோ மை ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டெபியூ அஸ் a மியூசிக் கம்போசர் 
on the time lay the show is happening so it feels like many blessings are happening at one time so we'll definitely perform a few of those songs as well shri satya narayanam upasmahe nityam shri satya narayanam upasmahe nityam satyajnanandamayam sarvam vishnumayam ji anari super sir thank you thank you is an independent musician yeah. so every independent musician want to love from people so you're doing a lot of stage shows how do you uh, feel now about the respect uh, response from the audience because a lot of people is fall in love with you it's a blessing uh, i started releasing music in 2009 through youtube i was in college so i was making music in my dorm room in boston and when i was doing that i was just doing it because i loved the music and i i wanted to get my voice out uh so in the journey ipti pohona i never actually it's surpassed my dreams um and to be able to have the love of the fans to perform in front of thousands of people and um it's beautiful and one thing i'll say is even to this day that same love that same passion for music that was there when i was a college student in the dorm room it's still there now it's only grown so it's a blessing i'm humbled and Uh, I'll also say even though I've been in the industry now for 8 years it still feels like it's just the beginning there's so much more that's to come sir the voice ku nariye vere namasitsita maarunganga indha maari voice nanga indha voice varadhukku enna pannanum nariye paadargal irukanga nariye tv la paadi irukanga or tips ah solunga enna pannu na na minnale sonna indha anoda voice ke na responsibility eduthuk mudiyadhu ena that's something that you're born with so i i don't um yeah i don't say i i can't take responsibility for the voice itself but for upcoming singers aspiring musicians uh two things i'll say the biggest thing first is hard work uh to this day uh, i practice carnatic music for about 2 to 1/2 hours every day uh, as long as i'm not traveling and um and that's not to say everyone has to sing only carnatic music or that but practice whatever your uh mode of music training is practice every day that's the biggest thing nothing replaces that uh second is don't chase fame just chase excellence just uh 2012 la adiye vandad enak adukapra 2014 la ennodu nindal both songs i i got to sing for my guru rahman sir um but other couple may there was not many songs happening it was just kind of slow up went in uh but on that time la naena pannena i just made sure every day i practiced every day i made music i was composing every day i was dedicating myself to my craft uh and because i fell in love with the process of singing with practicing with making music then things started clicking for me so um fall in love with the music not with the fame or don't idealize the fame idealize wanting to become the best musician you can be that's two and then three uh don't try to be like other people don't imitate others find your own voice find your own vision and go after that with a fiery passion i think these three things any young or old upcoming musician there's no age you can be 50 and still decide you want to sing or whatever so whatever the age it is if you're starting off just these three things is what i would say that's it uh where are we no. yeah. so rahman sir vandu nariya improvise panna allow panuvanga singers sir raja sir kuda neenga psycho song pannirundinga so adula vandu avar particular ah the tune la neenga correct ah pannano abingra mari demand panuvaru ingra mari nariya singers solirundanga so how was the experience working with raja sir or correction illa rahman sir improvise illa okay avar enna pannuvarna he knows exactly what he needs so he'll give you different ideas to try so under with it la recording panacha it won't be a set this is it he'll have different ideas na anga pocha na idu try pandren sir adala no chance he is at the top of the mountain i'm climbing the mountain so uh that's what he will say 
because he is letting this composition evolve in the studio. He has a multitude of ideas. So these are all ideas coming from AR sir, not coming from the singer ever, right. uh, including myself. That's one correction. Two with Raja sir, he knows exactly, instead of letting it evolve in the recording, he's already envisioned every last detail of the song. So that is set before the recording starts and then we record it. So in that way it's different. But in the specificity of what each of these legends want, that's the same. They know exactly what they want and they have their different processes of getting it. That's the only difference. Two lines from Monan Energy, please. Uh, I'll do it at the end. We'll just finish the right, question. Right. Yeah. I want to make sure I get the lyrics right. So yeah. Yeah. And yeah, I said. Yeah, I said like Ninga Padra almost uh, ninety nine percent of songs all me periya chart bust right there. So like when you get into a recording for a new song, does this add some burden of uh, responsibility or extra pressure to live up to your own benchmark? No, I don't think so. Um Every song is different. Every and there are isolated experiences that are not related to the previous song at all. Uh, I try not to. I don't even really check like charts and stuff anymore now. Maybe like two, three years ago I did, but now I. Um, I never want to get caught up in my own hype, so I try to ignore all that stuff, because the minute that happens, then I'll start having that pressure you're talking about. So it's just every song is a new experience, every song is its own world, and the composer has their vision for the song. So the only thing I think about when I go into a recording is, uh, what did the compo composer expect of me? How can I give my heart and my own uh, DNA to this song, to give it my life? Uh, so in that way, it's, it, and I, I don't think, Perform Panache, compose Panache, I don't think about anything else. I try to turn my mind off so I'm like I'm blank and I'm just as present in that moment as possible. The minute I start thinking about, oh, is this song going to do well? Uh, will this be as big as my last song? Then the magic leaves the room because music is not from here, it's from elsewhere, you know. So I, I try just to keep my mind shut and let the music just channel through me and do what it has to do. One more, like, uh, you songs, you know, all the melody or some western touch like the songs are very good. Like, you know, local, folk, kut, and the many genres, like, do you have that instinct to... Yeah, one of the songs I sang for Raja Sir from Tamil Rasan, Vijay Antony's yeah, movie, is, is a folk song. Yeah. It's my first one, I think. Uh, and I love the way that song sounds, so I think there'll be more. Uh, hi, sir. Hi. You are a singer and now a music director. Yes. Any plans to act in movies? No, not not right now. No, I don't think so. I, um, I've kind of dedicated my life to music. <laughs> He's saying we should. Uh, Raman, sir. Um, Raman, sir. Uh, yeah, his voice is a gift to the universe. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't know. I I won't say never, but. I'm also not really a good actor. Cameras make me a little nervous. So I say that as there's all these cameras here. But no, not for now. Right now, music and only music. I put down a music director, a music direction. So I can give you a time. Maybe five years from now, if you ask me the question, I can give you a better answer. So independent music albums, uh, videos, and the other thing is interested in the future. I'm not doing it. So in the beginning of this year, I released my. First self-produced full-length album. Yeah. Um, it was all in English. The next one I'm working on will be multilingual. It'll be in Tamil and English as well. Uh, so yeah, that's like uh, he asked in the beginning. That's how my career started. So, uh, and I think the demand for different kinds of music. You know, if you look at Vanam Kottatum songs itself, the the sound of the album is very different than what you hear right now. Uh, and I think that's going to be my role in this industry as a music director to offer a new perspective. Um, so I'm taking the same kind of spirit and essence that I felt when I make the independent music and I'm breathing that into the cinema side. Um, and yeah, that's what I want to be able to do. I love all forms of music. Um, I think as a musician, singer and a creative person, the creative drive... Uh, Constant pursuit, always trying to push boundaries, always trying something new. Um, this uh, being a music director itself, it came at a time for me when 
I felt like I needed something new in my life, something to push my boundaries, something to really kind of push my own limits. So I'm always trying to do that. I never want to get too comfortable. So yeah, sure, maybe sometime in the near future. And uh, Sid, in the show, the pair all of no hit on the Siddha which is. So if you want to ask him, why did he keep it? I think that would be a right question for him. I I can answer that. Uh, so I think the first place on the 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 world is in an interesting place. The whole world is in an interesting place. I think there's a lot of divisive energies and um. And firstly, Sona Madri, I think music is the strongest, most powerful tool to spread love, because music now is an energy form, the sonic energy. It's 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 a form that I think can shake people on a very subconscious level, beyond words, just spoken, beyond um, many other actions. Music can molecularly kind of change the way people think and feel. Uh, na direct away and the effect part that i've seen when i do a show i've seen the way other people's music impacts me raman sir wrote a part to a part of coke studio land it's called nan yen pirandin um that song even to this day if i hear it like two lines and i'll start crying and that's the kind of power music has uh, about two years ago after every instagram facebook twitter post na and the all love no hate i started putting it as a tagline because I felt like for me personally I wanted to remove any feelings of hatred any feelings of jealousy these normal human things that everyone feels these tendencies from my own heart so it was a way of self cleansing so on the process la uh, simultaneous I you know the fan base one started really growing 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 so then they started seeing me use this and they also started using it and I saw that the phrase itself had a very positive impact and it was a way for people to remember to choose love instead of hate it sounds cliche and it sounds a bit um uh yeah a bit cliche but i think it's very true uh it's a simple decision one can make to choose love instead of hate so um this show this is my first time doing a larger scale show here in chennai and my goal is to spread as much love and to create a really really positive space with the people of this beautiful city um and that's really the goal uh with this first of feb eighth show and then the whole south india tour um and i can't wait because when you do that you feel like you're actually changing the way the world moves and that's the goal telugu lium padina parisanta ninga paadina pad nala vaikunta puram paina like it's a sensational chart buster maximum views likes so how do you like uh, how's your comfort level with telugu diction pronunciation and all that right. um well telugu is not my first or my second language um but i think the language is very beautiful so it's something i'm constantly working on uh with samajavaragamana i was very happy obviously with the response obviously um it's a uh, it's just a great feeling you know so to get the love of the telugu speaking audiences and to get their support is very heartening um and the pronunciation is something i'm constantly working on but my background is in carnatic music and uh, most jagraj activities or um, a lot of them are in telugu so i grew up singing so the pronunciation or like the phonetics is not too foreign to me um but uh i'm always trying to improve in every area musically singing wise pronunciation wise so that's something that's also a constant work in progress uh hi sir you are from the us any plans illa illa chennai la da okay i'm Please. from chennai i grew up in the us okay. but i'm from here from here so you grew up there any plans to uh, record music and eventually win a grammy award i mean that's uh if it's in god's plan sure i'm going to keep recording music uh and my next album like i said will be in english will be in multiple languages they'll also be tamil in it but um yeah to get that kind of recognition from something like the grammys would be great but uh, one thing i've learned is not to chase awards uh i'd rather make an album that is super impactful that is really embraced by people all around the world and as a byproduct of that if something like the grammys happens then amazing um so i won't say it's a goal to get a grammy it's a goal to make an album that i can really get behind and feel super proud of uh and if a claim comes from that then um i'm obviously going to be happy yeah.
ஸ்ரீராம் சார் இந்த நிகழ்ச்சி டிஃப்ரெண்ட்டு ஆட்கள் வருவாங்க ஒரு லவர்ஸ் வருவாங்க அப்பா மகன் வருவாங்க அவங்களுக்கு எந்த மாதிரி பாட்டு நீங்கள் பாடுவீங்க ஸோ எனக்கு ஒரு டிஃப்ரெண்ட்டான பாட்டெலாம் அமைஞ்சிருக்கு கரியரில் ஸோ யூ டேக் அ மரு வார்த்தை விச் இஸ் அ லவ் சாங் தென் யூ ஹவ் கண்ணான கண்ணே விச் இஸ் ஃபாதர் அண்ட் டாட்டர் குறும்பா ஃபாதர் அண்ட் சன் தென் யூ நோ ஜஸ்ட் தீஸ் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் கைண்ட் ஆஃப் இமோஷன்ஸ் ஸோ வில் பெர்ஃபார்ம் ஆல் ஆஃப் தோஸ் and what i think i love about my shows and about the way me and my band perform is we don't really um anyone can come and enjoy it it's definitely for any age group from a little 4 or 5 year old to the oldest person and they can have fun uh yana na and the shows la the biggest thing we do is we make sure that we perform without apology we perform without any inhibitions so if we do that then automatica the audience also feels like they can get up and dance and move and clap and again from the youngest to a 19 year old teenager who who wants to be cool to a you know a 70 year old you know elder person who just wants to come and have a good time and move about there's no uh it's it's just a very pure energy that that gets formed in these shows and um that's what i love most about them actually that's not completely true our full day on panir kare thalli pogada illa na full i started at 10 am we finished by 6 pm so it's not all the way true i i create at whatever point whenever the inspiration hits we create that's all so adana sonne night time matto illa any time he feels like making music அது நிறையா பேர் சொல்கிறாங்க அது ஃபுல்லாக ஐ டோன் நோ அதான் நான் சொல்கிறேன் த பிக்கஸ்ட் சாங் ஐ சாங் ஃபேர் சார் வாஸ் டன் டூரிங் த டே டைம் மார்ச்சோ வாஸ் ஆல்சோ டன் அரௌண்ட் ஃபோர் பிஎம் ஸோ இட்ஸ் ஐ மீன் பட் மேபி ஈச் கிரியேட்டிவ் பர்சன் ஹேஸ் தேர் ப்ரெஃபரன்ஸ் ஆஃப் வென் தே ஃபீல் லைக் தே கேன் ரியலி சேனல் யூ நோ ஸோ இட்ஸ் பின் அ டிஃப்ரெண்ட் திங் சம்டைம் சம் ஆஃப் த சாங்ஸ் ஐவ் டன் திஸ் கண்ணு தங்கம் சாங் விச் வாஸ் த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் சிங்கிள் uh that i did during the daytime uh and that kind of came together over a few days then uh one of the songs in new year country which just released two days ago that was done mostly in the night uh we i composed it in the evening time and then we finished it by let's say like 3 4 a.m so we worked through the night so again i don't really say this is the time i like to, some days i wake up and first thing in the morning i feel like going to the studio and making music other days uh day title la onnume varad ideas la onnume varad night time la suddenly something will come and we'll just go for it so it just depends on when the inspiration hits see so apart from recording what did us to you performing on the stage personally or what do you feel inside when you're performing on the stage when i perform on stage again my mind is off i i'm just in another zone kind of it feels like uh another energy from elsewhere has come and i'm just channeling that and there's an interaction between me and my band members where we'll all like look at each other and there'll be this intensity where we're all sharing in this collective joy and that joy goes out to the audience so i don't really think about anything i'm just trying to uh like i said be empty it's almost like a form of meditation where you forget yourself and you just become a center for this energy to go off like the one thing i tell myself before i go on stage is be an energy center like just collect and give collect and give that's that's kind of like the idea but i don't think about anything the minute you start thinking on stage that's when the show starts going down so well that can be anything from a a cinema show independent music carnatic music all of them it's just you want to go there just be present and just uh, surrender to the moment so chinna isle music director writing romba young age le music director writing matha music director la sitram namalku competitor writer nu ungala paada koopida matanga bayavida matinga ah கூப்பிடுறாங்களே <laughs> 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 
பறந்து போன அழகா யாரோ அவளோ என்னை தீண்டும் காற்றின் விரலோ யாரோ அவளோ தாளாட்டும் தாயின் குரலோ உன்னை நினைச்சு நினைச்சு உருகி போனே மெழுகா நெஞ்சு உதச்சு ஒதச்சு பொ பறந்து போனாழகா தேங்க்யூ